remember who came up with it. Oh, he's going to say he did. Um, because I did. Uh, maybe he did. It's not a very good name. <laughs> um, uh, <laughs> it's it, it, You can't name this show. like And really, uh, it, on music, if something's written for like one piano, four hands, two pianos, four hands, um, it says that on, on the books. And so um, Richard... I guess, said one day, what about two pianos, four hands? And we just thought, well, it does describe what the show is. For people who play classical music, they immediately know what the reference is, that they've seen that on music books. People who don't just go, so there's two people always going, so your show, four hands, five pianos, two hands. No, they, they say two, two hands, four pianos, which I always right. say, well, that would be a neat trick yeah. if somebody had two hands and could play four pianos. When we did time. a matinee in uh, Winnipeg, I believe, the lights went down. And we were almost in the round, so I was sitting at this bench, and there's a lady sitting like right, right here, like this far away from my back. And the lights went down, and he and I were at these two pianos, and and in the dead silence, she went, two pianos, four hands," and then the audience just lost it, like they just, they just, and then we lost it. We couldn't start playing. Ted actually did come up with two P four H as a kind of thank you, uh, thank thing. you. Well, you yeah. I remember you saying that it's an impossible show to describe yeah that's what we found like when people have never seen it say so what is it and I go oh god it, it, it sort of follows our lives but it doesn't really it's not linear but it's kind of episodic and there's music in it but it's not a musical and we play the piano but we're not piano players <laughs> And we act all these different parts, and then by the but time, we're not actors. But we're not. No, no, we are. That's we about are. all we are. Yeah. Actors.